Heads up, dude! <laughs> hey! Get it back! Oh, come on! Just one punch and you fall? Man, you really are weakling! <laughs> <laughs> Aww, you're gonna cry now? You're such a loser! <laughs> That's right! Scram! <laughs> Here. Let me help you. Who... are you? What a weird dream. Wait, seven twenty-eight? Huh? Oh shoot! I'm gonna be late! I need to get ready, quick! Hello? Vivi, where are you right now? You're running late. I know, I know, I'm almost there. What even happened to you? You're always earlier before. Well, um, I, um, sort of overslept. <laughs> no worries though, I'm almost there. We'll make it quick. Oh, she's taking too long. There you are! Come on, we've got work to do! Ma'am, please have a wait. Your meal, sir. Phew, that's done. What on earth are you doing? You're paying in the middle of work again? Oh, come on, Feli. I finished my task. I just got here. 
At least help Grayson with the supplies at the back, or Mallory with the dishes. I will, I will. Uh, just let me log in first, I don't want to miss my streak. <sighs> Whatever, just do your job, will you? Hey, what's cooking good looking? <laughs> hey, Feli, just doing the next order. Oh my gosh, that smells so good. Yeah, it does smell appetizing. Do you mind if I taste it? Not at all, here. Wow, Vivi, this tastes wonderful. Hey, I want to taste too. <laughs> sure, go ahead, Mallory. It's so good! I want more! Wait, that's for the- Whoa there, hang on, Missy. You completely forgot that that's customer's order. My point exactly. Aw, come on! Just one more? Babe, no. Stop whining like a little kid. <laughs> Don't make that face. I might kiss you. I won't even let you, you dork. All right, Felly, I'll help them out. There you go again, you lovebirds. Stop making me feel like I'm single. I mean, you are single, right? <laughs> Why is the world so cruel to me? Not my problem. Go find the lover yourself. <laughs> <laughs> ha! That's what you get for playing too many games. <laughs> At least my game cares about me. Says the one who always loses in tournaments. Shut up, man! Come here! There they go again. Stop. Fighting like a bunch of kids. Tell, Tell me, me about, about it. it. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, come on, Vivi. One more spoonful, please. <laughs> Don't worry, Mallory. I'll make you some later. But for now, this goes to the customer. Ugh, alright. Fine. Well, I can't blame her. Your cooking's really that good. Mm-hmm. Aw, thanks. Speaking of cooking, we're almost out of stuff at the back. Can someone buy them? Is nobody really gonna do it? Well, I guess I'll do it then. Are you sure, Viv? What about the soup? <laughs> if you're really concerned, Zyrol, you could have offered to do it instead of her. Use common sense. Oh, shush. At least I am concerned. Plus, Belly wouldn't let me anyway. Knowing that you spend the money for your games instead? Yeah, definitely would. <laughs> Don't worry, the soup is actually already done. You can put this in a bowl and serve it to the customer now. Oh great, I'll do that. Here's the list of things that we need. Do you need anyone to go with you? Nah, it's alright. It's just a couple of things. Plus the grocery is just a few blocks away. Well, if you do need help, just give one of us a call. Got it? Got it. Thanks guys. I'll get going now. Be back ASCP, okay? There might be some customers that'll come. I know, don't worry, I'll be quick. Okay, now that's out of the list. What else do we need? Fruits and vegetables. Grayson didn't specify which ones, so I'm assuming it is the usual. Oh man, this is a lot more than I expected. And I thought it was only a few things. I shouldn't have underestimated the power of groceries. Where is the... Whoa! Whoa! Hey! Watch where you're going, miss. Oh, I'm sorry. I wasn't looking at my way. <sighs> it's alright. Just watch out next time. Mm-hmm. Will do. That 
was embarrassing. <sighs> Note to self, watch where you're going next time. Okay, I finally got everything we need. This took way longer than I expected. Huh? Where the heck is my wallet? It was just here. I didn't lose it, did I? Oh, great. I lost my ID and the cash that Feli gave me. Now what am I gonna do? Oh, shoot. Pick up the devil. Hello? Hey, Vizzy. How's the grocery shopping going? Are you almost done? Well, not quite. I still have to look for more things on the list. Are you okay? It seems like you're worrying. Did something happen? Uh... Whoops. Sorry, Feli. I have to take another call. I'll see you later. I'll be there in a while. Oh, sure. Hello? Hello, Miss Vivian Gomez. Yes, do I know you? No, you don't. But you might recognize me when we meet. That won't be necessary. I'm hanging up. Wait, I got something for you. You're gonna need it. Why would I even need something from a stranger? You'll see for yourself. Tell me, which counter are you at? Counter? Why should I tell you? I don't even know you. How did you know that I'm in a grocery store? Are you stalking me? Why am I even doing this? What was that? I already said it earlier. You will recognize me when you see me. What do you mean? Ah, never mind. I see you. You're at counter two. Uh huh? Hello? Hello? <laughs> he hung up. What does he want from me? How did this person get my number? I need to get out of here. Quick! <laughs> Hold on. Huh? Where do you think you're going? What do you want from me <laughs> you see told you you'll recognize me when you see me well what is it that you want i believe this belongs to you <sighs> it's all right just watch out next time mm -hmm. will do Huh? Whose wallet is this? Vivian Gomez. She's the girl who bumped into me earlier. <sighs> she really needs to look out for her stuff. M my wallet! Don't worry, I didn't steal anything. But how did you get my number? Uh, your wallet? Oh, right. There's a card with my number here in my wallet. Right. Wait, where did you- I believe you dropped this somewhere. And? You didn't insist on handing it over? I prefer calling this number than disturbing someone's privacy. You prefer snooping into my personal information rather than actually returning it to me? Yeah, lame excuse. Forgetful and clumsy, aren't you, miss? <laughs> excuse you? Look, I was just preoccupied, okay? I admit that I was not paying attention to my personal belongings, but you don't have to rub it on my face. Should I apologize? Oh, I'm sorry, ma'am, for stealing this wallet of yours. <laughs> if you're just making fun of me, then I'm not gonna accept it. <laughs> If you wish. But, hey, thanks for returning my wallet, Mr... Uh... Kyle Rivera. No need to say the mister. Noted. Thank you, Kyle. Don't mention it. Be careful next time. Jeez, the audacity of the guy to make fun of me. People these days. Oh well, at least he didn't steal anything. Um, miss, you're holding off the line. Are you gonna buy these or what? Huh? Oh, right. Sorry. <sighs> Finally. 
Back at the restaurant. I probably won't do this ever again. I, I'm so Wait, sorry. Mallory? I, like what is going on there? Are you blind or something? Look at what you've done! Sir, please. It was an accident. We Feli, what's going on here? Thank God you're here, Vivi. The customer keeps complaining like he's a Karen. First, he complained about his order for taking too long. Second, he complained that the appetizer was a bit too salty. And now Mallory accidentally spilled a drink on him. I'm not sure what to do. Ah, uh, jeez. Hang on, let me try talking to him. Uncoordinated waitress. Sir, what seems to be the problem here? Excuse me? Are you the manager here? I want to file a complaint. Uh, no, I'm the chef here. If you want verbal action, I suggest you to be likewise. If not, I would suggest taking the action of talking to the actual manager instead. I don't care for your stupid suggestions. Your co-worker here just spilled iced tea on me. She doesn't know how to do her job properly. Sir, I- Shut up! I don't care if it's an accident or not. What's important here is what happened to me. How are you gonna make up for this? How are you gonna fix this mess? Hmm. How about this then? Since this happened with a misunderstanding act, your order will be paid by our co-worker. What? Right? Uh, sure! I'll pay for your order, sir. Good. How about it, sir? Do we have a deal? Hmm. I can't say no to free food, right? Just make sure this will never happen again. Got it? Noted. My apologies for the inconvenience. Uh, whatever. Vivian is scary at times. Well, you should have been more careful. How come you didn't see the table on the front though? I got distracted. I was checking my phone. So, that was what you were doing, huh? Yeah! Oh, uh, hey, girls. Th that's not what I meant. I, uh, checked my phone because, um, I got a message. <laughs> <laughs> you need to work on your excuses, Mal. Or just don't try to make any at all and tell the truth. Felly, I'm so sorry. So sorry, I promise this won't happen again. You said the same thing two months ago. Hey, sorry I couldn't do the grocery shopping. I just decided to viral. Hope that's okay. Felly, I'm sorry for using my phone in the middle of work. I promise it won't happen again. Hey, sorry I couldn't do the dishes. I had a message about something important. I'll make it up to you tomorrow. Sorry! Sorry! Super sorry! 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 <laughs> <laughs> you know what? This gives me an idea. What do you think about adding a policy where phones and gadgets should be confiscated, hmm? What? Oh, come on, Felly. What about Zyrol then? How come he gets to play with his phone in the middle of work, huh? He has too much screen time, you know. Excuse you? You have tons of social media updates during work. Says the one who's playing a game right now. Game? Ha! <laughs> Got him! Let's go! Oh boy, here we go again. Cyril! What are you doing there? Take the damn trash out before I beat you to bits! Uh, uh, yes ma'am, yes ma'am, I'm doing it right now. <laughs> I am just gonna do my task now. <laughs> I don't want to end up like Cyril there. That means you too, Missy. Get back to work. Ugh, fine. Talk to you later, Vivian. Phew! Finally, the day is over. I'm tired. Uh, same here. Me too. I think we can all agree that we're tired today. Hey, put your heads up. Dinner's ready. Oh, sweet! What are we having tonight, Viv? You'll see. Oh my stars, these look so good! Dibs on the chicken leg! Hey, I wanted that part! There are literally two legs. <laughs> well, 
Bon appétit. Huh? There's a customer. I thought we're already closed. Hang on, I'll check it out. Sorry, we're closed. You can come back tomorrow. Well, well, well. What a pleasant surprise. Another season is about to begin. Are you all ready? Yes, ma'am. I'm excited how this will turn out, especially on their gourmet. Of course, it's the star of this show after all. What about you, chef? Anything to say? Let the feast begin. Hello there, my lovely seagulls. Siege here. That was a voice crack. <laughs> anyway, hey, it's Siege. Thank you so much for watching the first episode of A Memory's Recipe. And I have to apologize for its delay. Originally, it was supposed to be released on late August or early September, but I underestimated the time bound, so... Yeah. <laughs> but I certainly hope that the wait was worth it. If you enjoyed the episode, make sure to leave a like. Comment down below if you have any theories in mind. We would love to hear them. And don't forget to subscribe and turn that bell on ring a ding ding so that you won't miss an episode or any video from me. The team and I are working so hard on this project, and we really appreciate your support. Thanks so much for sticking until the end, and we hope to see you in the next episode. Siege out. <laughs>